Well, North High is always one of my favorite graduations to attend to. It's a small community. Everybody knows each other. Uh, there's a real family feel to this community, and so it's always great to come up here.
Street, distinguished guests, parents, administrators, faculty and staff, and my fellow classmates of the class of 2017. I stand before you today with a complete report. This very moment marks both the end and the beginning. It seems like just yesterday we began this journey together, and now we are about to embark on a different one separate. We have shared our lives together with one another, countless memories, laughs, and sometimes we even cry together too. No matter where we go in life, we must always remember the huge impact that the small town world has made in our lives. We will always be equal. Though we are taking different paths, this tie will bind us from here to eternity. My fears, ahead of us stands life, so let's live it one steady at a time. Thank you. Many of you all know me as a proud person. Yes, that is true. I'm going to continue to try and change that. Just a few days ago, I was afraid that she came from the crowd. Our former president, Barack Obama, was here, and he came on the floor as well. He did what he did, and everybody would do, but it is not. It takes patience, it takes commitment, and it comes with plenty of failure along the way. The real test is not whether you are worth this failure, because you're wrong. It's whether you live hard or shame you into an action, or whether you learn from it, whether you choose to persevere. To our parents, teachers, counselors, and advisors, for always being there, thank you. For never giving up on us, thank you. For not allowing us to give up on ourselves, thank you. I love you all, thank you for listening. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my extreme pleasure to recognize the following students as the honor graduates of the North High School 2017 graduating class. Talia Tiana Wise. Brooke Miranda Baker. Angel Lynn Hegler. Erica Tynesia Malik Dash. Destiny Victoria Benjamin. Jesse James Alexander Scrock. Taylor Renee Ryder. Whitney Shakesia Ambrian Hayward. Chelsea Bahama Blue. Jacasia Jacaria Rowe. Tamaya Tamal Brooks. Jason Charles Brinson, Alexis Nicole Ann Rutman, Jonathan Brian Addison, and Alicia Davis, JC Mason Brain Schultz, Raylan J. Jeffcoat, Chase Allen Wallace. Creatia Angelique Johnson. Elizabeth Nicole Maxwell. Chloe Elizabeth Maxwell. Sarah Allison Mitten. Equatia Ajane Johnson. Savannah Ray Williams. Shatia Janae Brigman. Maquel Malik Davis, Tahira Andrea Jones. 61% of our graduates are our graduates.
I've got some of our senior administrators here with us, Faith Arthur, Bill Clark. We were talking about scholarship rate for the last several years. Gates, Millennium Scholars and all that. How are we doing this year? Scholarships are awesome. Um, students continue to receive lots of scholarships. They are applying for lots of local as well as national scholarships. So we are continue to increase in this area. Um, North this year is around about $3.5 million so far. And so we'll continue calculating until the end of the summer before we turn in our talents. But 3.5, so you know we're gonna we're looking at about five at the culmination of the whole situation. And I, I believe that. Ms. Hook, tell us about your area. Tell us about your involvement, your role, school district. You well, my role is as administrative services. I handle parents. I work with the guidance counselors and the scholarship and just work with graduation. And we're very proud of North High School and their graduation ceremony. Tell us about the importance of this event and what's, what's going on in District 5, if you will. Well, it's a wonderful event because it gives us an opportunity to salute all of our graduates um, who worked extremely hard over their high school career. And this is their culminating experience. So we're just very proud of them and their culminating achievements. Oh, it's wonderful to see, to see that students have conquered 12 years and ready to go out in the real world. And hats off to them, they're so excited about their future. And over 61% of the students in this year's class met honor recognition, so we are very proud of them. And it is a great honor to be here and to be able to participate and see the students as they walk across the stage and get their diplomas and to see how happy their families are. Thank you. Ms. Milhouse, tell us about today's graduation, if you will. I am so happy my son has graduated. Just Jay, she just really puts herself in everything she does. You're going to college? Yes. Where are you going? Claflin University. Oh, yes, she is. It's she's a big, very big happy. What is she going to college? What is she going to do? Yeah, she's going to USC Aiken, take it up nursing. Can great things come out of North? Yes, they can. Yes. And your it, all, is it all depends on the students and the parents pushing them to do what they need to do right. Right. Jake, my son. Oh, your son graduated. How old is he? He's 18 years old. Is he old. going on to college? Yes, he is. What school is he going to? Newberry College. Newberry College. Her name is Briage Angelique Johnson. Oh, is Briage, is she going to be going to college? Um, actually, Briage is going in the Air Force. Okay. <laughs> I know you're very proud. I am. I'm so excited. Taking steps forward. Oh, and ready to change the world. You're strong enough to move mountains. I think you can. I think you can. And you are one in a million. So move ahead with confidence. Sometimes it's hard to start a new chapter But just remember you're the author of your life adventure You're gonna show us how it's done Oh, for generations to come You're strong enough to move mountains, I think Anybody who's watching our show today, um, if you'd like to get involved with our school, give us a call. We'll tell you how you can get involved and help volunteer, help in a classroom, help a student. Mm -hmm.